Hello booktube and welcome to the penthouse. It's hard to believe I worked three jobs to build something like this. Ain't it? <laughs> I live in eastern Kentucky so you know, the economy's not all that great around here. It's no excuse though. Anyway, on we go. Uh, this is the 19 random facts about yourself that may surprise people. Give me a second. Let me have a sip here. My apologies to people that don't like the sounds of people drinking and swallowing and whatnot. Because I've heard that on some of these random these random facts things. So my apologies. Alright, let's get on with it. Nineteen random facts about yourself that may surprise people. Do you make your bed every day? No, my wife makes the bed. Um, your favorite number? That would be Bill O'Reilly because whenever I tried watching him, I just felt kind of numb all over. Oh, wait, it says number. Favorite number? Oh, that'd be 56. What's your dream job? Like every other writer, it's to be able to make a living writing fiction or whatever it is that you... Right. Uh, you might hear some chickens crowing out there. Um, would you go back to high school? No, because I was an introverted, uh, non-popular guy. High school wasn't the greatest of experiences for me. Um, I hung around with the nerds and the jokesters, even though I was working out and learning martial arts and, you know, boxing and stuff like that. I was kind of with the crew that I liked. I, I had no problem with the jocks, but this is just the crew I hung out with. So no, I wouldn't go back to high school. Can you parallel park in under three moves? Now, under three moves, that's less than three moves. So it would be 2.9 moves, 2.5 moves, so no, I can't parallel park in under three moves. You know, and where does the move start? Is it when you pull up to the vehicle in front and the parking space is back here? And then you do this? No. Not going to happen. So no, I cannot parallel park in under three moves. It's physically impossible. Which, you know, reality is indivisible. You folks know that, I'm sure. A job you had which people would be shocked to know about. I was a mental health aide for better part of two years and I took care of developmentally disabled people uh, people that were MI people that uh, schizophrenics and you know stuff along those lines it was a state funded agency that I worked for um, do you think aliens are real hmm uh, yeah I do can you drive a stick shift? Yes, I can. Guilty TV pleasure. I don't feel guilty. I, well, first of all, I don't watch much TV. And I don't feel guilty about what I watch because if I watch anything, it's usually the Big Bang Theory and I don't feel guilty about that. Tattoos. Yeah, I got a few. That's a homemade one. It's a Cobra emblem off of a, a car I think my uncle had. We traced it. We did the old needle and thread and uh, India ink. So that's all homemade there. This uh, I got at a tattoo place and I uh, looked through the catalog. It's supposed to mean pride or symbolize pride in Japanese, but for all I know, it could stand for shithead or something. But uh, Okay, if the world ends, do you want to be a survivor? That's question number 11. Yeah. Yeah, 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 because uh, they would need charismatic leaders with survival skills, and that's me. Um, things people do that drive you insane. Um, hmm. Probably pause for a long time without answering a freaking question. 
Uh, do you have any birthmarks? No. And I'm hoping I won't have any death marks. I'm hoping it's a peaceful passing. Um, favorite childhood game? Doctor. That was only if the girls in the neighborhood my age were willing. I'm lying about that. I never played doctor. Question number 15. Do you talk to yourself? Do we talk to ourselves? Yeah. Apparently, yes, we do. Um, do you like doing puzzles? I sure do. I like a good challenge. Favorite music genre? This is question 17. Um, I don't have a favorite. I like all music from Baroque to um, the Blues, Muddy Waters, John Lee Hooker, to uh, punk rock like Killing Joke, um, to Native American folklore like Marie Sue. You get the, you get the idea. Uh, tea or coffee? Both. First thing you remember wanting to be when you grew up alive. <laughs> uh, the reason being, uh, my brothers and I were, we spent a lot of time outdoors and I wouldn't say we were accident prone, but we seemed to get hurt a lot because of what we were doing and stuff. I mean, I was electrocuted when I was 11. I thought I was going to die then. I fell off a culvert, jammed a big stick right up in here. Um, boy, it, it, it would be a long list if I thought about it. Uh, but there was a lot of times when I thought I wasn't going to make it to adulthood. So uh, that's what I wanted to be when I grew up. I wanted to be alive. So that should shed a little light on my childhood. So Anyway, that's the... Uh, 19 random facts about you that may surprise people. So, thanks for tuning in and uh, bye.